Anyway, let's see where we're at. I don't actually remember. I think just escaped from a thing. And it was a really, really hard to escape from thing. Some guys shooting shit at me with their arrows that they had unlimited versions of. Hopefully it loads beyond that. I can't remember when it last saved. I don't remember where we are in this game. We're just going to have to uh, deal with it. Maybe it'll load sometime. Aha! There we are. Yes, we just got shot at. Oh my gosh! Lee, what's wrong? What's wrong? The goddamn ambush! There's a goddamn ambush out there! Holy shit! Are, are you okay? Got an arrow. And it's here? It's out of the shoulder. Property? Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? <laughs> oh my lord! Some bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark! Oh my god! What happened? He got shot with god. an arrow. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. Captain I'm fucking fine. obvious over here. I should just. Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. Brenda, we'll I don't think anyone wants down. you to have them. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? <laughs> we ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down. I really down don't tight. like you still. So much for your, so much for your understanding. Shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. That's why you didn't Listen, go out there with us, with son of a people, bitch. But we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're going to let those sons of bitches get away with this. Do you know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down. But I think I know where at least one of their camps are. Okay. We're ready to go scope out that bandit camp. Come find us. This doesn't sound like a trap at all. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Yes. Oh, cool your jets there, okay. Rambo. Okay, Rambo. Nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah. That's not all. That's real charming, Dad. You got coming out of your ass. Where's Ben and Carl? You also got Since poop. Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get Coming us, out of there. she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Chatting amongst yourselves, eh? Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. The fucker I wanted to fix the like swing. Swings. A swing. I love swings. Just like at my tree house. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. So, uh, speaking of that kid's name, I just realized where his name came from. His name is Duck because his parents watched the shit out of Duck Dynasty. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Why not? And if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. His name's Duck, Lo Wang, and they're fucking hillbillies, so obviously they love Duck Dynasty. That's why I say that. You go to Walmart and you see Duck's Dynasty shit everywhere. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Fucking hillbillies okay? in there. Yeah. Weird I'm just a stuff that they like. Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? You got lucky out there. It'll have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Yeah, we have to make sure Wang, that's because you don't live in Texas and see Walmarts in Texas. I want you to stay lucky too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Duck okay. Dynasty shit is everywhere. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Oh, that's yeah, nice. Does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Sure, why not? Yeah, I'm not sure when. One day. Things have got to get back to normal. That's good. 
I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. I gave her hope. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Yes, he Death Panda knows all about all fucking yeah! Duck Dynasty. Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. In the goddamn South. All right, let's talk to this here Kenny fella. Stop swinging. Oh God, I can't get to him. Where are you going? Do you have to go around? Oh God, he's got to go all the way around here. Okay. That's very good that you have to talk to him right there. Hey, Haley. Hey. Found anything interesting? <laughs> You see me walking around there in front of you. They have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right, provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around. And let me know if you find anything. Okay. Else. I'll do that. I guess uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. I am. You're with me on this, right? Oh. Yeah. Fine, I'll pick fucking yeah, Kenny. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about these fucking things. Fucking Kenny. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. Well, fuck They've you. Food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. That's funny, considering you didn't seem too worried about Duck back at Hey, Herschel fuck Farm. you. That's in the past, Kenny. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long I was... to scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those. You don't understand, Kenny. Right. Your kid Let's killed a man. Find out. And he doesn't even feel any fucking grief about it at all. Oh, I can talk to the kid. Look at the swing. There we go. Let's look at the swing. Gotta walk around this side to look at it. Look happy. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks there, friendo. Hey, he's just gonna be a fucking giant pussy and not do a damn thing. Gonna swing with this kid while I go take care of the goddamn bandits. I'm storing gasoline all over the property so they can just, you know, do shit. No, I didn't use my controller. I'm still just using mouse and keyboard. Hey, good. I'm glad I know these things. Good. Don't piss on the electric fence. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna go with with Lily. If Lily's more of a a dick, and Kenny's more of a pussy, I'd rather go with the dick who fucks pussies. Oui. And then I can be the asshole, so I can shit all over the dicks and the pussies. I think that's what we're gonna do. I like that plan. Let's go, asshole. Side with Lily. Fellas. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? <laughs> Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. Fuck but you. How? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the <laughs> woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Sure. Wait, hold on. Not now. I gotta go look out that gate. Just need to check on a few things before we head out. Sure, that's understandable. Talk things over with you. Yeah. Group. Just come find us when you're ready. And I know I'll dicks fuck that. assholes, Joff, but... Doesn't happen all the time. It's a really rare occurrence. And even if I get fucked by the dick, 
That's not gonna stop me from still shitting on that dick. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. And ain't no feeding station for no cow. Oh, my friends are over here. Alright, Lily. You're with us. We're on your team, Lily. It's here in this here barn. Take a look. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Yeah, just take shifts. Lots of hay. Lots of hay. Enough of these might work as adequate cover from arrows, if that becomes a problem. Oh, I'm glad you're thinking about these things here, buddy. I'm certainly not. All right. Cohen. Lots of cohen. Like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Actually, I think the teeth amount in Walking Dead here seems to be about the normal amount of teeth that you'd expect. Sometimes, dicks fuck assholes. Talk to the damn lady. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? That'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. Yeah, shut up. How could you all bring us to this place? I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Oh, you got him. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. Did I? I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? Yeah, sure, why not? You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Why don't you keep talking to her, motherfucker? Hey. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I didn't ask you, motherfucker. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. So about my dick. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm Well, shit, it's been three asshole. months? Yeah, well, don't <laughs> expect that asshole. to change. That's just how he is. God damn it, Lee. So he's the asshole. Does he treat you like that, too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? You know what else is yeah, hard? he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably going to keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. And he's going to die. Think our little arrangement with them was a good idea? Well, I'd like to be asking that now, don't you think? Dad's you right. old man. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. I'm gonna go check things out. Oh, no, don't, no. Nosy. don't These be hasty. These people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where hey, it don't belong you. and getting us thrown out in our asses. Old man, I'm not gonna deal with your shit for much longer. Wait, doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. Old man. You are going to get thrown out the first second I can get you killed. Going down, Bob. What is it? You're going to die, old man? Is that the quote from uh, Happy Gilmore? Whatever the case may be, any chance I get to get him dead, he's going to go down. Hey, Lee. 
Hey, you mind about going out to track down them bandits? Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Oh, so the Let's price is wrong, Bobby. I'll stay here and hold. Is one of the other one. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Duff, I don't give a shit if I get my ass bit in the end. None of this shit matters. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. I mean, it matters in the scheme of the game, but who the fuck do I care? I do things that, you know, everyone else is expecting me to be like, be a good guy and be all on everyone's side and try to be neutral and shit like that, then that's not going to be very fun to watch. Fuck that shit. I've decided. I'm picking sides. See anything? Not yet. I see a lot of trees. Some leaves. It's around here. It's gotta be He's going to shoot me in the back, isn't he? Can. I found a can. Here. Oh shit! You found it. I did find it. Good job, me. Two men forward. I think is what that little hand sign is supposed to mean. I'm actually not sure. I got a lot of food there. Sneak up to the camp. Okay. You see anybody? Snuck. Stay on your guard. This doesn't look like you're staying on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tan. Really doesn't look like you're staying on your guard. Probably a zombie. Jump scare! Hey! Oh. Okay. Clear. Now the jump scare. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. They Take got a lot of soup. Anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. I don't see why I should trust this guy. Let's look at the kettle. Oh, they've been here pretty quickly. It's pretty warm still. Just water. They've been here. Recently. But you got some crates home with this trash. Some cans. I don't need that. Oh, wait, Chris, I saw all the food over there. I'm gonna go get it in a minute. Nothing. I just wanna look at everything else. I like looking at things. Empty. Empty. Why would you do that? What are you doing? Why'd you push it? What's with you, Lee? Looks like they expected to be here a while. Yeah, because they have a chair set up. They totally expected to be here a while because they have a lawn chair. That's totally what it is. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Yeah, as in just before we were here. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Shit. Why is that guy still just looking in the tent? What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Oh. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. Yeah. I'll pass. Hey man, you could use those cans for some stuff. Why do I keep moving stuff out of the way? Oh. Get that there. Hold on. Let's check the shopping cart out real quick. Mm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Moving a lot of stuff like I'm moving boxes. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. I don't think so. Oh. There's a camera what here. You find? A video camera. Let me see that. No, I'd prefer that you didn't see it. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. 
What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? Eh, no, kind of. Keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Hey, fuck you. I'll run whatever democracy I want. By myself, if I have to. Can we leave yet? Fucking holding the gun. Goddamn lunatic. Oh, yes, let's just hop on in there then, I guess. Photo here. Mom and a baby. Jesus. Is a kid mixed up in this? Looks like we need to save another kid. Was more like. Was? Uh oh. Oh, man. Oh, shit, there's something in there. Oh, hi. Shit. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Okay, hey, Jolene. We had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh. oh. I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. What does he do, you Jolene? Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here Fucking in the woods. Crazy ass you gotta bitch. come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. Oh. And into your goddamn brain. Okay. You're men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. Yeah, where the fuck did you get her hat? You. Where did you get this hat? A little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell are you talking about? You Clem's about? mom? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. You then I'm gonna sound head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person. Really I fucking see. crazy. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what but happens, mom, one of us is gonna kill you. I probably Look, should uh. They could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the, the dead, dead folks, folks you own. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. <laughs> tell him what you got in mind for. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I did choose not to shoot her because I thought that was Clem's mom, but maybe it was just a random person with a fucking hat. God damn it! Well, thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. Yeah, fuck you! Thank you for shopping at Save Lots. I love you. Thank you for shopping at Save Lots. I love you. It's a clean fucking shot, idiocracy. Though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. What's a waste? So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. Give me that crossbow. Good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. There you go. Grab that shit. Not you. Fuck. Now we have. We too have unlimited arrows. Come on. I suppose that's true. It was a waste of a bullet. Yeah, she was a little bit crazy, I'll admit. Still. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? <laughs> you ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. I didn't even You're see back. who it what was happened? that shot it. Handled it, Mama.
How's a friend? This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Missing every day. Every day. It's grown up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh boy, here we go. Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Chris, I wasn't asking what's going, what's going on. on. I'm being hypothetical when I ask questions. Problem looks like if I like specifically I want to actually know what's going on, I will specifically say, hey, someone tell me what's going on here. Let's see. They have different ideas about how oh, okay. we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, whole thing. it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir crazy when they're telling Everyone's how hungry. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm bandits. sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. The I think fuck? I'll go up and look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lassie. Okay. It's true, I guess. You should go check on the farm cow. Singular. Hey there, Clem. I got your hat back. Oh god, she just shut the thing on me. We'll give it back. We found it. Very important to Clem. Clementine. Alright, first I gotta talk to this here Danny fellow. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. What? My girl here. You really like that gun. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Just kinda creepy, that's all. Just, Just a bit. Kinda creepy, that's all. Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I ever know. Danny noticed your suspicion. Fuck you, Danny. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. Oh, did you eat the school kids? How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry, too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. Yes, I'm, I'm sure we are. Supper, then. It'll be a good one. Oh, it will be a good supper. Magnificent. Great. Just gonna get on out of here. Yeah, Joff, my suspicion that he rapes his gun. Or his gun rapes him, you know, whatever. Oh god, that looked like he was got startled when he walked in there. A little bit of startling things found. Lots of license plates up top. Cows dying. Oh, it's heads up it's now. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, Clem. This is gonna be like Jurassic Park where the cow sneezes all over her. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. Oh, good. We'll see, Clementine. We have to do like a birthing QTE? Oh, what is that? What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Salt lick? Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. I see you've already tried. Lick it. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, shit. We're checking the stalls, see what's going on in here. Not that much. Just want a clem of my own. Well, Joff, have some kids. You'll get a clem of your own. Basically, and that's how it works. Oh Just God! Stay close to your mom for now. Okay. You probably don't want to play in the hay. They've got zombies inside there, probably. They use their hay baler to make zombie hay bales. That's why their the guys are sick. He said he wants to play on the hay. 
Empty, they don't got no food. They've been lying to us. This is all bullshit. Oh, what's in here? Some shoes? I don't know what I like about I don't know if I like this. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. People they've been killing. Fun. Shit's gonna go down. Surprised they don't care that I'm just opening and looking around at things. It's a feeding trough. <laughs> Thanks. Mwah. Fucking cows. Yeah, not much going on in here either. Alright, let's start talking to people. Duck. But you gotta save yourself. Anything? No, not really. Hmm, it smells funny in here. Like shit, right, Lee? <laughs> That's correct, young lady. Hey, don't use oh. swear words, okay? Okay. <laughs> Seriously, don't 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 even worry about it, Clem. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. The old nod. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Fucking eyes. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he oughta. Thanks. Yep. Okay. The cow? She looks skinny. Okay. The cow looks skinny. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. That it? Here, Clementine. Found this. My hat! You found it! I don't even remember when she I lost knew it. You find it. You said you would. Listen. Did you Shit, did I? give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Oh, that's right. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Got one right now. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. You pat the shit out of that cow. I am gonna go open this door back here. And be told not to open it. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. Behind this I gotta door. Quick look. They got boxes of stuff. Something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. Fuck you. I Stop being a pussy. On this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. Clem it's all the protecting. The guy with Katya. What's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. Oh, okay. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your God hand, Kenny. damn it, Kenny. All right, Professor, what'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. So, it's got some screws and a lock. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock. Fuck you. It's just because I'm black? Why would you say that? You racist motherfucker. Well, you're, you know, urban? You are a racist. You are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Urban. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> hmm. What? 
See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. So right. clever. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. <laughs> can I help you boys find something? Sure. Just gonna What's behind this door, Andy? Come right out and ask. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, All right. Uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, Mama gets nervous. Fuck Andrew, Mama. I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Sure sounds like you got some tools in there. Let's see. What do I got? Jacked Andy to get him out of the barn. How am I fucking supposed to distract people? All right, Andy. Let's tell. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Danny mentioned he needed something. Distracted. Say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Crisper, I'll go outside when I'm good and ready to go outside. The moment, I'm gonna use this cow's face. As a screwdriver. Oh, I can't go outside now. Oh, maybe I can. False alarm. I'm back. False alarm. Shit, man. Now I can go outside. The false alarm. I like how it's really, really dark in there. Not so dark out here. Oh! <laughs> Look how charming he is. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without him. Just wants to get himself into that. That there. Ooh, Lily's by herself. Quick, while she's alone. Talk to her. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? Yeah, there is something a little bit off at the barn. There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. Bitch, I will and decide what exactly how much do you trouble think I'm supposed to do about it. If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. Yeah. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. What were you and Kenny arguing Indeed, about? Indeed, like the Walking Dad, Robot Junior, 4525. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting I'm to think the Twitch chat, there has another agenda. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. All right, Lily, fine. We can't really leave here, so I'm gonna go find a screwdriver. Yeah, Danny said that there were just tools in there. I I tend to think that there's uh, some dead people or soon to be dead people. That they're cannibals. That's what I think. Ah, oh, the toolbox. Great. Kenny said that there's something in there. Ooh, a multi-tool. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Excellent. Oh yeah, Kenny said that Lee is urban, implying that I could pick locks because I am urban. That's what happens. Pretty good time. All that there racism. And it's dark again outside. Shit, I hey using the thing. Andy. Hey there, Andy. Danny needs something again. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. He knows that I'm fucking with him now. Quickly. To the door. Okay, let's do this. 
Kenny, keep an eye out. False alarm. I'm back. Motherfuck. Kenny. God damn it. I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What Why the fuck generators? don't you do something instead of me, you piece of shit? I picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right. Good to hear. God fucking fuck you people. He's not much of a lookout. You kidding me? He is a shitty, shitty lookout. Fuck these guys. Do everything myself. Doesn't look very safe, but I guess that's Just stuff unplug it. Fine, let's do something with the generator. No. Oh. Oh, look at me. Sabotage. Damn. Listen, all of y'all, this is sabotage. Sabotage. There, that should do it. Yeah, let's make it not run entirely. That was a really fucking horrible idea. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Oh, son of a. Fuck! Oh, Alright. Have fun with that there, buddy. I don't know why Gurk isn't in here. I don't think Gurk likes us. Or me. Such a such a bad bad influence on everybody. There we go, back to nighttime. Yeah, Gert's probably at work too, that's the other thing. It's fucking noon in Japan. He's got stuff to do, man. Hey, Kenny, how would you be a good lookout this time? Uh oh. Motherfuck, really? Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Dinner okay, time! Honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, okay. come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. Yeah, oh, Kenny. excuse for you. Get that thing off. Alright, can I do it now, finally? Not even a QTE, it's just one at a time. Are you even catching these fucking screws? You have to screw that shit back in. And then all the zombies come out. <laughs> yep, they're eating people. Not zombies. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Boy? What you, who you calling a boy? <laughs> Look, I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idiot brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. <laughs> Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. <laughs> yeah, this is going to turn out well. Of course I lied to Andy. Fuck that guy. Oh, 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 Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody's going in your butt. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. No, oh, they already fucking ate Mark. Shit. Mind if I wash my hands first? 
bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Yes, ma'am. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. I like actually wash my hands. Gauze pads. Good. Okay. I could use a shave. Why don't you do it? Some kind of lotion. Oh, it's a poop. So I take it I'm not actually sneaking upstairs. Look at me sneak. Motherfuckers can't hear me sneaking. <laughs> Shh. I don't think there's anything in here, but let's just look just in case. Uh, farm books, cookbooks. Nothing out of the ordinary here. What's that on the blood ground that there? Blood? That could be blood. Not gonna lie. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Mark has been turned into a hamburger. He is what we will be eating tonight. What do they need so much morphine for? Candles. Smart. Yes. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. Keeping him alive. What do farmers need with this kind of stuff. They can chop him up. Huh, where is that cord going? Let's plug it in. Let's be helpful. the hell? Oh. There's a room in there. Okay. Just gonna have to find out how to get in there. There's light under here. Oh shit! Oh shit! The hidden door! Hey, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. Of course I'm gonna open it. What the fuck? Mark. What the hell happened? He's missing some feet. Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? It's out of day in. Eat dinner. <laughs> Lieutenant Diane! Clementine! Clem, don't eat that shit. Clementine before she eats. Oh god! Clem! Clem, no! Don't eat that! Huh? Yes. Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Fuck you. Now, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat? So you green as people. What the hell? Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Fuck all you. Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. A guy named this is Mark. Dead, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Lee. There you go. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's All right. How I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? 
to continue to rot till they eat some more. Yep, Mark we Burgers. We can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Fuck off, we're leaving. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. And you enjoy it. Like y'all. Oh. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere. God damn it. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of go here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Fuck Everyone, you guys. Shit's gonna be alright. Okay. Lee? Lee? Hey, fuck you. Did you just... Oh, motherfucker. You fucker! I'll tear you apart! Oh, it's Mark. Hi, Mark. He's a zombie now. Please. Oh. Oh, he's still alive. Someone. Ah. <gasps> no, you fucking piece of shit. I will destroy... Everything Open that you stand for. Door. You can't keep us in here. <coughs> Open up. I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bang. bare hands. We gotta find another way out of here. That's right. Yo, Throw up all that good food. Bastards. Open this door. God damn it. Copier, my hair is way better than Tommy Wiseau's hair. Down. Fuck you. It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet- Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Yeah. You okay, Clementine? Ask about Clementine. They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm-mm. Oh, man! Ah! Lee, you. Those psychos have my Old man. And we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn- Gonna have a the fucking- the one who brought us here! Will you all Another heart shut problem. The fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. I'm MacGyver my way out of this fucking place. Got some pallets. Okay. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? Could there be? Why don't you move them and find out? No such luck. Please settle down. I'll rip your goddamn what about these off? shelves? The pretty sturdy. We could climb up, uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. Okay. Come on. Okay. Got some boxes here. Meat. Uh, I don't want to know what kind. There's marvelous on the way. Let us out now if you want to live. Salt licks. Salt licks. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. They're not going to open the door. You, you think a you could throw it to the air conditioner, though. You the right to chop hmm. people into meat. Oh. I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you you're can't not. Get... Yeah, I fucking thought so. God damn it, old man. Easy. Now you're gonna become a burger. Dad? And he's dead. No, Dad, come on, Dad. Oh God. Did he's I like hit breathing. his chest? I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. With a salt lick. He dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not. Dead. You know what has to happen, Lee. Oh, I do actually. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. Here we go. But in a few minutes, Salt lick to the head. In a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you. We can bring him back. Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! But he is dead. Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. But that man all is right. dead. Alright. You both know what about happens. time to be an asshole. Got a shit all over everything. Back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. God Duck damn it, I picked the wrong one. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. I. God you got damn it, whoever's I back. Need you. 
Please help me. How the fuck am I supposed to help you? You want me to kiss him? Come on. Lee, is he breathing at all? No, no, I don't think so. All right. Let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Assholes and dicks are friends. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn. You're putting all of us at risk, you son of a bitch. You're fucking worthless, Lee. Well, there it is. Keep going. Keep going. Oh. No! <laughs> what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I'm still trying to pump. You, man. I know, Madden Grab. That's what I was trying to do, but... I'm sorry. Lee just no, stopped pumping. Oh, me. that's a lot of blood there. Look what you fucking did to Clementine, you piece of shit. God damn. Are you okay? No, she's not okay. Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know. I know. But you need to be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Yeah. Hopeful. Think about unicorns. Like what? How about your walkie talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you That was probably a bad better? option. Sometimes we're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I think so, actually. I'm working on it. Look at Larry. I'm sorry, Lily. Just take the salt lick off his head. Ooh, we gotta walk all the way around. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. You've got to think about saving your own life now. It's what he would have wanted. Yeah, something like that. He also would have probably not wanted to have a uh, giant salt lick thrown through his head. Behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. You got this, Clem. Does Kenny. the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off. If I had something to remove the screws. If I had a multi-tool multi in my pocket that of I've been course. carrying around for a little while. Maybe there's something oh, else shit. we could use. I've got a rock. <laughs> no, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. I like how no one else is trying to fucking help us here. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. Just me and Clem trying to figure shit out. No one else, apparently. Who gives a fuck? I'm gonna check Larry's pockets for some coins. Give me a coin, Kenny. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who I... didn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive I just, this shit, I want a coin. Gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. I didn't want. Or at least one of us has got to. I didn't care. I just, well, yeah, there we go. Need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Fuck you then. Larry got some coins. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here, but I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? <laughs> I know this is a terrible time. He probably does have a coin. Motor in. Larry. Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. All right. Let's go check some pockets here. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? <laughs> Let's take a look. Alright, guys. we got a couple pockets to check. I'm going to check his cock pocket. Here we go. Oh. First try. And a dime. Cock pocket, always the right pocket. Try and get out of here, and then we're gonna go ahead and end the stream for the night. Screws and get this unit off.
Look at them their quarters. Being useful as shit. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Kenny. I will beat the fuck out of you. God damn it. There's a reason I'm not on your side anymore, Kenny. Probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Sure, Clem. You sure? You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. I don't know when the uh, auto save. What's fine. the auto save button? What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Duck is already turned into some Peking duck dish. As his name implies, he's quite tasty. Kenny. Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. We've given you like five minutes already, lady. We're good. Okay? Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Good job, Clem. There we go, this is probably a save. Aha! We will stop here for the night.